कन्वर्ट द फॉलोइंग सर्किट इन टू थे सर्किट एक्रॉस ए एंड बी वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस सर्किट इन टू इट्स इक्वेलेंट थे सर्किट सोल्यूशन नाउ हेर वी कैन सी बिटवीन टर्मिनल ए एंड बी देर इज सिक्स ओहोम रजिस्टर सो आर एल इज इक्वल टू सिक्स ओहोम नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड आर टी एच एंड वी टी एच सो फर्स्ट वी विल फाइंड आर टी एच सो टू फाइंड आर टी एच वी हैव टू रिमूव दिस आर एल एंड टर्न ऑफ ऑल दी सोर्सेस सो हेयर वी कैन सी दिस इज अ वोल्टेज सोर्स नाउ वेन वी टर्न ऑफ दिस वोल्टेज सोर्स सो इट विल बी शॉर्ट सर्किट अगेन दिस इज ऑल्सो अ वोल्टेज सोर्स इफ वी टर्न ऑफ दिस वोल्टेज सोर्स सो दिस विल बी शॉर्ट सर्किट अगेन एंड हेयर दिस विल बी आर टी एच बिटवीन टर्मिनल ए एंड बी Now, if we stretch this terminal A and B, so the circuit will look like this. This will be of four ohm. and this will be of 4 ohm this will be terminal a and this will be terminal b now here we can see clearly that 4 ohm is in parallel with 4 ohm so 4 ohm parallel with 4 ohm this will be 4 into 4 divided by 4 plus 4 so 4 into 4 Divided by four plus four. Now this will be two ohm. So this is the value of R A B is equal to R T H is equal to two ohm. Next we have to find V T H. So to find V T H, to find V T H. Again, we have to remove this R L, and here, this will be our V T H. Now, to find V T H, let's assume this is mesh one, and this is mesh two. We need only mesh one, so we will remove this, and according to the polarity of this voltage source. Let's say this is positive, this is negative, this is positive, and this is negative. Now we have to find this current. Let's say this current is I. Now we can find this current I by using Ohm's law. So I is equal to V by R. V is here. We can see this voltage is twelve. Then This voltage will be minus twenty four. We are considering current is in this direction, so this will be minus twenty four divided by resistor. Resistor value is four plus four, so four plus four. So this will be. Twelve minus twenty-four divided by four plus four, so it is minus one point five ampere. Minus one point five ampere is the value of I. We have to find this voltage VTH. Now here we can apply KVL. So by apply, by applying KVL to KVL, that is Kirchhoff's voltage law to Mesh number one. So let's say we will start from here. So this will be minus twelve. 
minus 12 then this current is minus 1.5 minus 1.5 plus 4 so it will be like this minus 1.5 into 4 then plus VTH plus VTH is equal to 0 so this will be minus 12 minus 12 then plus in bracket minus 1.5 into 4 so this will be minus 18 minus 18 plus VTH is equal to 0 so therefore VTH is equal to 18 volt Now, we have the value of VTH, RTH and RL. So, from this we can draw Thevenin equivalent circuit. So, Thevenin equivalent circuit will be, this will be positive, this will be negative. Here, this will be RTH and this will be RL. So, this is RL this is RTH and this is VTH now VTH is equal to 18 volt RTH is equal to 2 ohm and RL is equal to 6 ohm so what we have to find we have to find Thevenin equivalent circuit so this is the Thevenin equivalent circuit.